did you know that during the recording session to Biggie's song, Notorious Thugs featuring Bone Thugs, there was so much Hennessy and smoke that all the Bone Thug members would fall asleep during the session without getting their parts done. And because of that, it would have Biggie, Puff, and everybody else worried that the song would never get completed. But Steve Lobel would let all of them know that it was nothing to worry about. This is pretty much how they work and they do this all the time. And as every Bone Thug member would wake up, it would prove that he was telling the truth because they'd go in the booth, knock out their verse with no issue. It was like they were completely sober. The crazy part about that whole recording session is every Bone Thug member recorded their part and Biggie listened to it, but he told them he was gonna take the song home and study it that way he could come up with his rhymes. He wanted to really perfect that. So during that session, they didn't actually record together. It was Bone Thugs recording their parts and then Biggie came back and recorded his part later. And Bone Thugs didn't even get to hear the final song until after Biggie died and the album dropped. And that's kind of sad because I feel like it would have been a dope moment in hip hop if they got to celebrate the release with Biggie. It would have been dope to see them on stage with Biggie performing that song at an album album release. So it's a sad moment for hip hop knowing that there's no video footage of them performing. But what I will say about video footage is Steve Lobel said during the recording session there was actually a camera crew, a professional camera crew there recording everything. But no video footage has ever been released. We only have like two or three pictures of the studio session. So just to know that somewhere out there there's video footage of that session it really fucks with me because i would really like to see that a lot of people speculate that puff has that footage but for some reason he's holding on to it and i would have to say i agree with that but hopefully sometime in the near future it gets released but there's a lot of good and bad controversy with that song because you got fat joe saying that biggie and puff were both reaching out to fat joe hoping that he could connect them with Bone Thugs to make a collaboration happen. But he was saying that the Bone members kept saying that they wouldn't do a song with him out of their loyalty for Tupac, which is understandable if it was true. But you got all the Bone members saying that that wasn't true, that they stayed neutral, mainly because Eazy-E kept telling them to stay neutral with everybody and to avoid any beef or drama. So that's how they stayed. They kept saying that the drama between Pac and Biggie didn't involve them. But no matter what, whatever really happened or didn't happen, it's still dope that we have that collaboration. But like I said, I just hope in the near future that footage of that studio session actually gets released because I think it would be a dope moment for hip hop and for all the Bone and Biggie fans. That song had no promotion behind it, no video, nothing, and somehow it became a fan favorite. And one of the most popular songs off Biggie's album, Life After Death. Over the years in interviews, Bone members have told stories about fans getting upset if they don't perform that song. So every time they hit the stage, they make sure to perform Notorious Thugs. But y'all let me know what you think about that. And also, what's your favorite verse on that song? Y'all let me know. Drop it in the comments.